Hello, ladies, gents, and fans of explosive fun. We return to Noita. We're going to maybe polymorph ourselves to victory. <laughs> you want this to fall upon my noggin? Please, there we go. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, oh, what? Excuse me? Oh, did they change it? I think they changed it. In between patch, in between uh, versions. Your polymorph, your, your polymorph self no longer has infinite flight. Is this the truth? Yeah, I can't, I can no longer go all the way to the top there. This is just, this is just not fair. This is not good. It's not right. Oh, that worked out. What the hell was this happening there? I have no idea. I tell you that I couldn't keep going up. I have no understanding of why that was happening. Is that a change that happened? There was a patch in between the last and this recording. Let's see. Polymorph myself. Go all the way to the top. No, no, no. Okay, well, what, what is happening? I honestly don't know. But uh, uh, maybe we can go up a little bit. Then polymorph self. Let's see. Get, get that full uh, bar. Go all the way up. Pull it more self. Nope, I have run out. Uh, but I think you do recover it towards the end of the polymorph. Aha, that is the way to get around it, I guess. So you don't get infinite flight anymore, which is, you know, very disappointing. Very disappointing indeed. Here, have a rock. Give me some cash in exchange. Here's another piece of garbage. Enjoy it. Oh yeah, with that cash. And of course, I'm going to make my way in there. Question, does acid destroy this thing? It does. Probably uh, pisses off the gods. <laughs> if we destroy this thing for real. We just continue uh, going in there. All I want is access to this stuff without actually destroying the entirety of the altar. It's good, it's still, it's still available. Let's see, does it still work? Well, inconclusive. Let <laughs> me grab it again. Are you gonna become gold? Yeah, you still become gold, all right. The altar, while battered, still functional. All right, and some kind of uh, monstrosity has awakened beneath the earth. All right, that was step number one. Step number two was to go get the warm egg, which now I feel is going to be a lot more challenging because we have no means of infinite flight. But I might still be able to make it there. I don't think I'm going to make it there from, from this side. Yeah, everything, everything changes. And... Except war. War never changes. I have caught a fire. <laughs> Maybe don't follow your very own trail of fire. Get wrecked, you stupid pieces of garbage. So we need to go all the way up here. I don't think it's that much of a challenge though, the, because this cliff, it's in fact not impossible. Yeah, we can simply fly around, grab the egg, and after we murder, this warm. I mean, we could also go in there, but eh. We could also drain, uh, because you can do something like this. Put the uh, the water on, and it will be getting filled up. And if you as you empty it, I guess you can just simply right-click it. It goes a lot faster to get rid of all the water. So it's a way to. Oh, I drank the polymorphine. Well, <laughs> and now I might be near death because I, I switched. Pretty sure that's poisonous. Like I, we did go down a little bit on health. Well, that's unfortunate. I, I must have misclicked or something. I don't know. I don't know exactly what happened there, but we can actually drain this of water. Actually goes really, really fast because uh, it's filling up the water as I drink it. I know I also drink the whole thing. So it's working out pretty quickly to drain this uh, of water. It makes it 
perhaps not impossible to get all the way up there. Of course, we will be facing an evil, murderous super warm, and there's no real point on doing this other than I wanted to demonstrate it that hey, this is totally uh, doable now. <laughs> Our Noita friend is able to drink several gallons per second. Never ending stomach. She just put a piece it out immediately. And uh, magic makes it so that the pee appears in a different dimension. So it's all under control. Eventually this will get drained. Probably this there's no need to to drink the whole thing. And I would assume I think that's the top. That's the top of the water right there. I just wanted to see how long it would take. No more water danger. Let's fill up the bottle again. Look at that. Prone salt. Amazing. With our arsenal though, we could simply blow our way into this place. But damn it. We did it. The crazy way. I thought there was supposed to be a worm spawning after you pick up that tablet. That's fine. I forgive you, Noita, for not being consistent with the threats that you have thrown at me. It was quite a few patches ago. Maybe it doesn't happen anymore. We had this extra life, but we already used it up, so we don't really have that anymore. So what happens if I just start throwing acid? Ah, it's not going to work because... I don't have infinite acid. We can maybe uh, corrode our way into the mountain. Anyway. Oh, I don't have polymorphine anymore, so I cannot make it all the way back up. That's alright. It's no big deal. Our mission will be complete once we drink the blood of this gross... ...warm. Let's throw this egg. And start murdering. Hello. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> don't get too excited. Oh, don't get murdered. This toxic sludge happening all over the place. I just want access to the warm blood. Oh, yeah. All in my belly. In fact, we could even bottle it up. It's gone, though. though. Oh, no. There she is. We're pretty close to death. I don't think these uh, worms have that much of a health pool. Yeah, he's dead. So we can continue doing death upon it. Let's see if we can uh, throw some water, get rid of the get rid of the poison of the sludge. That's like half full. I should have night vision right now. Let's go. See if we are able to see. Continue to fill up these. Drink a lot. All right. Let's find out. I'm very much looking forward. This is to the teleportium that we enabled earlier. Let's uh, create an outlet for this teleportium to stop being a pain in my asshole. Ooh, chaotic polymorphine. That can have some serious Serious uses. <laughs> a slight obliteration of that poor bastard. I like the psychedelic... Psychedelic lighting effect that we get. I'd like to have access to that area, please. We'll just pass it. That's really not a good uh, policy. Just make it explode. Far more straightforward. Not going to touch that. I say not going to get drunk, but I will set it on fire and corrode it because I love destruction. I didn't though. I didn't touch anything. <laughs> Why you have to do this to me? All I wanted was to gain access to the invisible area and have a good time discovering a tiny little secret in Noita. But no! You had to be a total scumbag and throw all kinds of dangers at me. Here's the place. Here's the place. Oh, we can see into this place. So you say a shape. Thing now is, am I going to be hunted? Can I make it? I don't know. 
Am I going to be hunted? By a horrible creature. Let's do this. Throw all this acid in there. We don't need to... Uh... Man, that's nasty. <laughs> we don't need to dig our way through or to swim our way through if we can simply explode in there. There you go. At least now we can see what the hell was hidden away all along. But hey, there's more world over there. Let's continue. This is pretty un underwhelming. I thought there would be a amazing secret. Is it was just a health upgrade. For which I'm health I'm I am grateful. I'm not terribly impressed with. Thing is I've never been to this area before. The world beyond. Twisty passages. Let's not forget there is an angered god guardian somewhere. Ready to obliterate our anuses. Oh, that guy was polymorph. I was like, what is going on here? Whoa, whoa what the the hell was that? Meat. Just a giant hunk of meat. Alrighty then. I'm very wet. So we can just go in there and get the money. Uh, the God Guardian is going to come around and just obliterate our anal cavity. For the time being though, we are free. Do as we please. <laughs> the lantern is just hanging from a phantom pixel. Is that Berserkium? I think I can just simply you know, drink the crap out of it and you get more, uh, more crit chance. I don't want to be polymorph. I don't want to be teleported though. I know I'm leaving all kinds of money behind, but I don't think money is what matters here. Well, that was a polymorph too. It's like, what the hell is that? What the hell just happened? <laughs> Something just critically hit. And created all kinds of amusement. Let's continue drinking this blood because let's not forget I have vampirism. Don't really care about the money. If I make more creatures explode. Here's another question. Is that meat supposed to be exploding? When it exploded, will it be all blood? Hell yeah! Boom! Oh, I didn't want to be polymorph. I am uh, amazing. Ah! Okay! <laughs> Oh, well, down we go. And what do we do now? <laughs> Extremely dense rock. <laughs> I've discovered uh, uh, a way to get through these levels. <laughs> Just fully morph randomly into a giant mega worm. And just advance. That's one way of doing it. Just explode this person and eat them. Still not forgetting that there is there is a god guardian real pissed at me right now. And I will give chase at some point and visit all kinds of death upon my person. But hopefully we can maybe just lose them in the caves. Huh? Maybe we can get that done. I would like to have more blood exploding so I can drink it. Really to resent the fact that my blood is, yeah, all this blood is uh, hidden behind. Oh, oh, everything's on fire. All this blood is hidden behind the polymorphium. What was the number one anyway? Oh, fireworks, that's right. I don't know if it's terribly useful, but it sure is entertaining. I can just drink this. Uh, very clear. Ooh, this is get wrecked. <laughs> I wanted to be a friend. There's no friends in Noita. Only victims. Continue being pissed. Uh, well, that doesn't look very friendly. How can you be polymorphed into a freaking turret? Makes no sense. I'm on fire again. Oh boy. 45 health. How did we drop so low? I'm having too much fun with this nonsense. 
Too much fun. This idiocy. Oh, that's a way to uh, get wrecked. <laughs> and then get teleported elsewhere and probably... Now we are, yeah, 19 health. Okay, give me that. Whoa! What makes that happen? I don't know. But it fills me with amusement. <laughs> Drink that blood. Drink it real good. Thing is that with the chaotic polymorphine. Well, that, that's on fire. With the chaotic polymorphine, the enemy, the enemy too, could morph into a giant super worm and just eat my entrails, right? So maybe be a little careful about that. I hate how you can't get through these lanterns without destroying them. There you go. Get real that nonsense. What the? Why though? It's put in my face. Three, four, four health. This vampirism is not working out for me. Uh, we're really close to death. It's not gonna work out. I continue going this way, and there's the dense rock. Like I am actually not going anywhere productive. We're exploring this area, and it just does nothing for us. So let's just go back, I suppose. Get real pissed him again. Does that do something against us? The the berserkium? Maybe that's what's creating all the problems. All these health problems. Berserkium, diabetes, hepatitis. Alright, not get the polymorph, please. I just want to drink this casual blood. Just casual blood drinking. Nothing nefarious going on here. Good old. No, that's a grenade. So I'm like, oh, is this a healing guy? Nope. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Well, you know, good old fun exploration. Always happy to engage in it. I don't like to get somewhere productive, though. I really don't like how it resets your inventory whenever you polymorph. Okay, I guess we'll uh, head this way. So, what is the point of these twisty passages? It does nothing. Does absolutely nothing for you. Oh! You scum. I wanted to dole out death against me. I want this polymorphium gun, but I'm too afraid to make things explode. I will just kill myself. I would like a little pool where I can put I mean, I should be able to just walk forward, right? Should be perfectly safe. Perfectly safe. Uh oh. All right, <laughs> made it through. What is that? I thought it was some kind of weird toad creature. There's the eyes. There's the mouth. But no, it's just an upturned cart. Well, I guess we could go back out there and try to go into the pyramid. It's not gonna work out very well, though. We got some chaotic polymorphine that we can use to fly pretty effectively. Not as well as we used to. I guess they deemed it was a little overpowered. But honestly, that is the first thing I, uh, the first change I see that kind of goes against Noita's nature of just have fun. Here's the tool, go have fun with it. You know, they, they change it so that eh, it's not as fun to use anymore. Not a big deal, but it, it kind of goes against that philosophy that I thought Noita had of here's this overpowered tool have a good time with it I'm pretty sure that's something that we had left behind that in fact looks like the starting wand what happens if I shoot at this thing it catches fire rotten meat my favorite kind of meat I have not lost sight of the fact there is a pissed off guardian. Probably ready to obliterate me. I am afraid to go down. Deathly afraid. Why well, am I going back up? Let's go to the, the pyramid. I mean, it would be nice to find a teleporter. That would be nice. Let's drink some more blood. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 sir. 
Not allowed. I'm a little salty that this wand makes the enemy... Oh, that's more warm blood. This is where we kill the other worm, right? A little salty that the... This current projectile sets the enemy on fire, so it's a lot harder to explode them. If we come across the pissed off guardian, I would say it's safe to say. We stand no chance whatsoever. <laughs> and once you anger the gods, do you still get to choose perks? Pretty sure you don't. Get wrecked. Guess we'll fill this up with water. So what am I doing? Am I keep going this way? Through the... Lake of Fire? Back to where I was? Or shall I try to go back to the pyramid? Let's just continue going this way because I think we're very, very close to death. Feels a little silly to try to go into that pyramid anymore. Like, if we manage to get some... I don't know why I'm trying to create this extremely reliable path. It's like, just make an island where you're going to land, you fool. Let's see if we can make some nice pools of blood that we can drink. That will be amazing. So we go back down here. I mean, my death is a foregone conclusion, I think, at this point. It was uh, a one-hit kill, pretty much. Hey, maybe we can find the entrance to the next level. We can heal back up. Man, that's far far down. I want to fall right on top of some aggressive member of the culture down here. All ornery about our intrusion into their inner sanctum. I think that's acid. You probably don't want to touch it. Well, that was underwhelming. Kabumo! Alright, please. Give me easy enemies that I can murder with complete impunity. You are not easy enemies I can murder with complete impunity. You're the opposite of that. You almost tried to kill me. That ain't cool. Alright, another death. Oh, yeah, there he is. I think the fireworks will explode. The corpses create all kinds of delicious blood to drink. Kind of sucks that there's a bunch of sludge behind it. Well, there goes his head. <laughs> whoa, whoa, don't spray me with that garbage. Big fan of heads of my enemies flying around. Very happy to see that take place. A right, fellow over here. Let's see if we can land a shot. <laughs> His limbs are all fell off. Please no. Oh, precious blood. Mm, yeah. No, don't poison me though. No. 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 Do it. Just come. My precious. Precious health. Some garbage. Oh, that's so annoying. <laughs> Poison. I mean, it, it kind of uh, follows me drinking disgusting poison. Okay, is that. That seems like a safe bet. Oh, man. No, that's not the path that I wanted you to take. Please. Please. There you are. Holy crap. Let me drink some water. For no reason at all. Okay, maybe uh, go down this path. It will be a little whoopee. Some true, some true fireworks going on over there. <coughs> oh no, no! Don't do it! Don't do it, fellow. We can forge a relationship. <laughs> Forge a relationship with my explosive, uh, explosive attacks. Well, I think it's quite clear by now that vampirism 
has not worked out very well for me. It's just really complicated to get those big pools of blood. That being said, though, a nice pool of blood right here. Let me just uh, get rid of the water. Can't say that I want the stupid oil in it. Oh yeah, this is actually a decent chunk of recovery. I mean, in the grand scheme of things, not a ton of health being recovered. Better than nothing though, it kept me alive to have that little bit of health, health earlier. Really cool explosions, never get tired of them. Ooh, there's more blood over there. Also, uh, some kind of evil creature that I don't want to mess with. So weird that this doesn't melt the ice. It's like a literal trail of fire. I drink this. Not very successfully. Seems like a good idea to create a passage. There's also... Oh, friend! No! Fireworks are exploding way early. <laughs> Once again, I find myself. Ooh! Perhaps the fireworks are not a great choice. Loving this pool of blood, though. Oh yeah! Get it onto my belly. Mm hmm. That worked out pretty well. Pathetic, starved vampire just slurping the dregs of anything he can find. All right, we got explosion on drunk enemies, bubble spark with trigger. I am not impressed with this, but eight spell cast at the same time. That has to be fun. That has to be a good time. Big mana max, no cast delay. Big recharge time, though. I don't really know, I don't really know. This is like my main damage dealer. I love this. Uh, maybe it's time to get rid of the fireworks. The fireworks seem to be very unreliable. Capacity 9. They have shuffle. I don't know. Uh, let's sw swap it for now. That is very underwhelming, but it has a very high capacity. I wish I could put all the fireworks into this one. That would be freaking hilarious. Mm. That would mean keeping both. I do like the acid, though. Having the capacity of melt anything in my path seems pretty damn helpful. Hmm. Hmm. Fire explosive projectile. This has been just killing me, right? I think that's a... Uh, I, I think the one is actually pretty good. Ah, let's just do this. I recognize the quality of being able to cast eight spells at the same time. I want my acid spells though. For no reason other than to have them. Check this out. Look at that. Melts. Melts everything. Is there any help to that? Is there any purpose? Probably not. But damn does it fill me with satisfaction. Watching the world collapse before me. Incredible magic. Whoa! No! No! <laughs> this is illegal maneuvers. Absolutely illegal maneuvers. Why do you get to shoot me from off screen? That's broken. I uh, sincerely resent that. Enemy shooting you from off screen. Always a big no-no in, in games. Noita doesn't give a damn. Oh, get wrecked! You wanted to see me. Well, you got a nice glimpse, didn't ya? Garbage person. Well, you want to go above? Oh, boy. Good damage dealer. Are you the idiot that was trying to snipe me? Yes, you were. Okay, so this leads to the Guardian and probably getting murdered. Let's do it. I'm going to go forward, get me my health. 
And then... We're going to go straight over there. Yeah, there you are. There you are. Oh man, he can totally... Oh, he goes around! <laughs> oh boy! Ow! Face! Man, I'm just catching them all! It's like they're Pokémon! I'm catching them all! Holy crap, we did not have... I think the acid could have maybe done it, it's the only thing I didn't try. This Guardian fellow is just too much. I cannot take it. I cannot take it, but the only way forward was the teleporting. I thought that maybe we had the tools to murder him. Quite clearly. We did not. <laughs> maybe I'll, uh, I'll look up how to kill him. What kind of tool do you need to kill this thing? I have no freaking idea. But, uh... Those explosions, I think they made them even harder to dodge. They are now homing. It turned around and just found my anus and destroyed, obliterated, made a gaping hole. Absolute nonsense. Too bad, though. I was so uh, excited to continue. That's <laughs> too bad. Uh, I mean, it got, they got pissed through no fault of my own this time around. It was not me at all. It was the acid. They just dropped onto the altars and corroded them. It wasn't me. Anyway, see you guys in the next one. Whatever the hell might that entail. Until then, just drop acid on everything and watch it all corrode.